28,000 of them things. We are moving up. GVO, look at top left. 17 game streak. I ain't gonna lie, I was running on the stage with my two-way slash and play. I decided to go to the park, man, get some double rep. And I decided to bring out my offensive threat build that I haven't used since November, bro. I haven't used a lot of these builds since November. Actually, I think this build was in January or February. I can't remember, bro. But y'all get the point. I haven't used this build in months. So it's not even a 95 yet. I only have an 85 ball handling. I only have an 82 dunk and an 83 three-pointer. No floor general on the team right now. My boy Robo don't even have the ability to change his playmaking badges. We're pulling up with builds that we're grinding. Only person that got a build that's already grinded is Clamp. And we're going against two SS3s, SS2. They're on a 17 game streak on the threes. They know what they're doing. And to not be able to dribble, not being able to shoot like I usually can or dunk, I'm playing with fire because I haven't used this build in a long time. I don't even remember if I can dribble on him off rip. But with playmaking takeover, I should be straight. Now right here, they get a good shot, but they didn't take it. Big Knight could have shot that. Once we saw that, we knew he can't shoot. So it helps our defensive scheme to know that there's really only two shooters. Now, like I told y'all, I'm ISOing. All right, ain't nothing changed. I made this build a long time ago to ISO when the behind the back was in the game. And right here, I get him. I changed my, cro my crossover to Pro 2 for that reason right there. Pro 2 crossover is way better when you're crossing over back to the three-point line. Pro 2 and Pro 5. Normal 3 is good to go up the court, but it's not as good to cross over to the three-point line. You'll get contested almost every single time. As y'all just saw, they got a bailout pass going straight out of bounds. I'm feeling it now. I know that I'm safe to dribble. I got a perimeter lock on me. I'm safe to dribble. I can ISO. I'm just going to be doing simple moves, though, because y'all know offensive threats run out of stamina very quickly. And I'm not even a 99.9. I'm not even a 94 overall. So I have to use IQ. You have to use IQ. But when I'm a 99, I can tell this build is going to be so deadly on the ISO. And don't forget about my boy Robo. He can ISO too. Right here, he tries to do a quick stop with the slash and playmaker. Two slash and playmaker, but he forgot his release is not as fast as the build he was using previously before this. That would have been green bean, but they got a contest on it. All right, they got a contest on it. Now, it's still 2-3. Nah, bro, I ain't going to lie. When he shot that one, I was like, yo. I don't know what's going on with them, but we're going to take advantage of this. Because as you see right there, 2K plays everybody. 2K plays everybody. <laughs> 2K don't care, man. It does not choose. It has no favors. Now I got to do some simple move that don't drain stamina and get the shot off quick. Because my speed is only a 90. It's 90 speed. Stamina is at a 96. Like, bro, this is a 6-3 offensive threat. I have to use IQ. Because if I'm going to use the IQ, dog, man, I tell you right now, that was a good move right there. He, he, he did a nice little crossover back to get a shot off. That's some of the moves that you just saw me do right now. If you don't use your IQ when y'all run with this build, it's going to be tough. I ain't going to lie to you. Especially if it's not a 99 and you out here ISOing. Like, I'm ISOing. I got him. I got him, Chief. Got him with the same move he just did. And even with the lag spike, we managed to green it. Now we got a two-possession lead. A whole two-possession lead. 17-game streak on the line. BP build in the building. We got the BP build. And we got, he takes a bad shot and he makes it. Come on, 2K. Please go back to how things were. Why can't we just go back to how things were in the beginning of the year, man? I ain't gonna lie. They need to take that move out the game next year. That little sham right there is, I ain't gonna lie, bro. You get ripped every time with that one. Now, right, right here, I'm, I'm blinking on stamina. I don't even have 99 stamina. I'm trying to create something. He got me on clamps this possession. So instead of trying to be selfish, I just pass it to Robo. And guess what he does? He gets us a bailout bucket. Now, they shouldn't have even been in the game. Should have been a three possession game instead of them making a 30 some shot contest. Like that, that's just fake, man. I wish he would go back in the, yup, as I said before, big man can't shoot. I wish they would go back to how it was in the beginning of the year, bro. When we look at that moonwalk, when if it wasn't green, it's not dropping. Just that simple. That was the only skill gap we had in this game. All right. They took out behind the back and they made shooting whites even easier. Come on. That's like that just takes away the complete little skill that we had. Because before the behind the back was patched, all these locks that you know of right now, you didn't hear none of them. That was a good dunk right there. You didn't hear of none of these lockdowns before the 
behind the back got patched. Only a few of them, all right? Some of them knew how to guard the ISO. But when the behind the back was in the game, bro, a lot of these lockdowns was on Sui. Let's just be real. But anyways, back to the game. We got 8-13 as the score. 17 game streak on the line. That's about two hours on the threes court, man. Especially since you don't have a logo over your head. I ain't gonna lie, that was a good move, but he didn't green it. That's regular 98, it looks like. That's where having a custom comes out clutch. But to his credit, offensive threat, he was probably running out of stamina. You have to do really, you have to know how to dribble. My boy Robo with a big green nose jump shot animation. <laughs> but hey, he gonna put it back on. But anyways, it comes in clutch to have a custom jump shot because there's times where you, you get no stamina on your offensive threat build or whatever shooting build you have, and a custom will save you. Regular jump shot? Nah, I ain't gonna lie to you, bruh. That one right there, I probably would've quit out after that shot right there. Cause I ain't even missed yet. I haven't even missed a shot yet on my BP and I'm running with it for the first time in months. It's not even a 95 overall, so I have to be creative with the dribble moves I do. I'm using Pro 2 crossover. I was not trying to do that move right there, but we're gonna go in the lane with that Hall of Fame contact and we're gonna get the slam. 818, I ain't gonna lie, I was expecting much more of a comp game than this. 17 game streak on the threes? I ain't gonna lie to you, they got a good lineup too. Maybe they were nervous, but taking shots like that just is not gonna cut it. All right, I will be honest with you. Taking shots like that, you don't want your streak no more. Cause when real comp pull up, I'm not saying I'm real comp, but when real, real comp, one of these stage lineups pull up, oh yeah, it's gonna be 21 over. You playing like this. I'm just gonna keep it 100. Cause I've been, I was playing stage before this. We won some games, we lost some games, all right? But there was few of them lockdowns, man, that you gonna need screens. And I was on a two-way or I was on my, my slash and playmaker in the stage. I didn't bring out nothing else. Well, actually, I did run with my pure shot credit. I was ice on with a pure shot and I was running screens with it. And it's safe to say that no build in this game really takes that much skill. As you see right here, I'm getting easy dunks. This build shouldn't even be allowed in the game. It's too dang cheesy, bro. Hall of Fame dunk and shooting. And at 99, you can basically move like you have Hall of Fame quick first step. That's tough, man. But anyways, man, I guess if they're allowing lockdowns to have 30 Hall of Fame badge, not Hall of Fame badge, but 30 badges with Hall of Fame tier, might as well keep builds like this in the game to keep it even. I see where they're coming from. Oh, also, man, if y'all watching this late in the video, big greens by my boy Robo. If y'all want me to start streaming, comment down below what y'all want me to start streaming on. Twitch or YouTube? I'm thinking Twitch, yeah, as a matter of fact, bump that question. I'm gonna start to streaming on Twitch. I'm gonna need you guys to go ahead and follow my Twitch, all right? Once I get like 200 followers on Twitch, not subs, followers, I'm gonna rock with y'all, man. I'm gonna start streaming. I'm gonna start streaming for y'all that keep asking me to stream. Now, let me tell y'all this before I even start streaming. This is a video game. When you come to the stream, GVO good vibes only, all right? Simple as that. We win or we lose, it don't matter. We're gonna have fun, we're gonna do our best. We're gonna go to the stage, we're gonna go to the rec, we're gonna go to the park, it don't matter. Whatever y'all wanna see, y'all let me know. My Twitch is Yard Man Gaming, got the same photo as my YouTube. Big up on the sub, big up Lord I might. What's on camera? Nothing like ah. Uh, GVO and a don't know all the thing. Go. Yard Man Gaming gone.